It's been a, a, a magnificent journey. We only uh, had the highest standards of everything, including our approach, uh, the mechanics, uh, the people who work with us. Uh, any number of people have worked with us for 20, 30 years. And the statistic of which uh, I'm most proud uh, of Grace Family Vineyards is not the hundreds by some wine critic or all that type of thing, but the fact that through the generosity of the wine community that we could solve uh, some of the uh, nutritional and educational problems that uh, confronted our brothers and sisters worldwide and uh, programs all the way from Napa to, to uh, Cambodia to Tibet, India, of course, Mexico, certainly, etc. So it's been, a, it's been great. So um, I've always had a, a propensity to find out people who are the very best at various skills. So I look to try and find those types of people to help me with the planning of the vineyard and people like Lori Wood and Dave Abreu and Jim Barber and Chuck Carpey and Mike Richmond and were just very helpful in uh, guiding me uh, during the uh, early years. So we planted in April of 1976. We were always looking to improve. We were never satisfied with uh, whether it was a pruning technique or, or being organic or uh, spacing of vines, leafing of vines, etc. cetera. Uh, when it went to replant the vineyard two and a half years ago, I seeked out uh, uh, Jeff Chudai. Uh, I know that he was working with a uh, project to effectively and efficiently help the vines, especially during their formative and, and, and growing years. So Jeff was so enthusiastic about his uh, product, he kind of brought me along. And it, plus, very simply, to a non-scientific mind like mine, it made sense. You know, it made sense. So we were lucky enough to have uh, uh, Jeff uh, install emitters at the base of uh, each vine. Uh, we had very good water control. Because of the drip situation, I don't know how many hundreds of gallons of water we've saved over the years, but it's been a lot because we have those little puddles that tend to stay on top and evaporate the water uh, don't exist. This water is getting very efficiently uh, supplied to exactly where it should be. So everything is a little bit subjective. I've talked to our son, Kirk, who is uh, director of Vineyard Operations at Stag's Leap Wine Cellars and has a great knowledge about viticulture. And uh, I've talked to other such people, our current uh, vineyard, vineyard manager, Kendall Smith, and uh, they have all agreed that the growth of our vines was phenomenal. Uh, the health of our vines has been phenomenal. The take uh, on budding was was above 98%. I guess I'm, I'm a strong recommender of this product and I wouldn't recommend anything that I don't believe in. I wouldn't do it for a friendship or for capital or for anything. But the goals that we set out were helped make possible by our time uh, of in installing the DRI system. And uh, everybody's happy with it, including me.